together and the Sylvester with my mind brooder, man friend. I really love him and I hope he will watch it and I know that he will be laughing. Oops! But this video will never be complete without the man behind this idea. My travel buddy, my cameraman, my best friend, my partner in crime, the love of my life, Thomas. Hello, I'm Thomas, yes. Uh, we hope and I hope that you like the videos and we do our, our best and I, we hope you feel good and you subscribe, uh, we have, you make us happy. Thank you very much. Bye. Bad Homeboy is classified as a listed site of historic interest because of Franco Blanc who founded the casino. The core park covers an area of nearly 40 hectares and is designed as an English landscape park. The Thailand pavilions are the evidence of the close band between Thailand full of traders and rich stone city dwellers who live in the magnificent stone build houses. Unfortunately, and due to the 30 years war, we can hardly see
In commemoration of the first coming of Christ at Christmas, it begins on the fourth Sunday before Christmas. This first Sunday of Advent marks the beginning of the Christmas season. Around this time, people start to decorate their homes and prepare Christmas treats for the upcoming celebrations. In Germany, the Christmas season is traditionally begins on the first Sunday of Advent. The air will be filled with a wonderful Christmas aroma because fresh baked treats such as stolens are being prepared. I was really praying for a snow when we attended the service, hoping that there would be snow since I'd never seen it before. I felt like I was a five years old again. The scenery changed from forest green to pure white, and I was filled with such a bliss. To see something for the first time is to see something in its purest and most childlike form of beauty. In Germany, the New Year begins traditionally with fireworks. Not big fireworks like what we have in Dubai, but ones that every German buys in supermarkets a couple of days before the New Year's Eve. A bottles of emptied sparkling wine offer halfway solid support for these noise makers. And at the stroke of midnight, fireworks start exploding everywhere. It's loud, it's smelly, it's hilarious. Fulda is a little town that lies on the Fulda River between the Rhone and Vogelsberg Mountains. St. Michael's Church in Fulda, Hesse is considered to be the oldest holy sepulchre church in Germany, built in the Carolingian architectural style on behalf of Abbot Eigel in the years 820-22. While Fulda Dome is the oldest pilgrimage destination in Germany, Along with the church in Salzburg, it is counted as a birthplace of Catholic Christianity in Central Europe. The Wasserkuppe is a mountain within the German state of Hesse. It is large plateau formation at an elevation of 950 meters and is the highest peak in the Rhone Mountains. Great advances in sailplane development took place on the mountain during the interwar period, driven by annual contests. Near the summit, there is still an airfield used by gliding clubs. The practical use of sleds in Asian and widespread world, they were developed in areas with consistent winter snow cover, as vehicles to transport materials and or people, far more efficiently than wheeled vehicles could in an icy and snowy condition. The generic term sledding refers to traveling down a snowy hill using a sled such Hello. as flexible flyer with wooden so slats nice. and metal runners. Yeah. The Rhone Mountains are a group of low mountains in central Germany, located around the border area where the states of Hesse, Bavaria, and Thuringia come together. These mountains, which are extreme southeast end and east Hesse highlands, are partly a result of ancient volcanic activity. <laughs> 